Hey there YouTube, it's Math Bowler and welcome to my TTM Monday video with my successful autograph returns from the previous week of November 1st, 2020. I have a total of 25 autographs from 7 people. I did really well. 21 trading cards, 4 index cards. And the one individual, I mean, there's a lot of TTM legends out there, but this one man in particular is definitely on that list, so um, he'd be a TTM Hall of Famer. But uh, I wanted to go ahead and get into this. The autograph addresses. Please do not ask me for addresses. Please do not. Uh, 15 bucks a year gets you a great, phenomenal database, SCN, or you could also do SCF for free. So I'll try to remember how often I send to these people. And how many days it took. Sometimes I forget to tell you that. But uh, Zane Smith, 4 of 4, took 11 days. I send to him once or twice a year. It's probably been over, well, yeah, about once or twice a year. It's closer to a year since my last time I sent to him. But, yeah, this came back in 11 days. He was a member of those early 90s Pirates teams. My favorite team, obviously. But uh, my golf project's going well. 4 of 4 back from Mark Kalkavecchia. And that took 16 days. Did a nice job signing on the autograph card. The next one, he's the TTM legend. He's a TTM Hall of Famer. Great guy who really does seem to enjoy signing through the mail. $5 per card. And uh, I had sent him a baseball with a larger donation, and he loaded them up with some amazing stats. So I send to him once or twice a year, Carl Erskine. And, you know, my favorite thing about him is his two no hitters and uh on the two index cards he wrote you know a nice inscription and on the other one he wrote me a nice note with an inscription so i actually got six items back so i, I would say four of four but actually i'm gonna call it six of four with a 20 dollar donation 10 days carl erskine and these two vintage cards look so nice with that autograph on there he's no young guy i mean we're talking you know, 94-ish years old. I just looked at the back of this card real quick and saw he was born in 1926. So assuming that's right, yeah, you're talking he's approaching 94 years old then. But uh, this old Donruss thread card, man, he knows he knows where to sign it. That's beautiful. Yep, in addition, 1955 World Series champs. Looks like he was a member of the 1952 team who was also in the World Series. I don't think they won it, but there we go. 19... Yeah, 1955, Darrell's World Series, Dodgers champs. Said Dodgers twice. That's cool. I like it. Thanks, man. Steven, thanks for writing. Glad to sign. Carl Erskine, 1948 to 1959 Dodgers. Brooklyn and Los Angeles. Okay, next up, Mr. Mark Carnvale. Only one of two, but actually you could say two of two because he signed the index card, but uh, only signed one of the two cards. 20 days. He did not sign my generic autograph card, and that's okay. Next up, two of four from Moel Day Moore. Super Bowl 43, Pittsburgh Steeler, Moel Day Moore. He only signed these two cards, which I'm glad he signed these two. He did not sign the Vikings cards. <clears throat> so he's either two per or maybe just wasn't in the mood to sign Vikings cards. But in any case, there's one. That's a nice numbered rookie. And there's the one I was really hoping for, and it came out great. He even added the inscription. That's awesome. The Super Bowl 43 champs inscription. Two of four from Moel Day Moore, 24 days. Um, I send to Moel Day Moore about once a year. But he hasn't been signing for very long, so that's probably the third time I've ever sent to him. David Edwards, three of three, eight days. You know, the golfers I've never sent to these golfers before, so no sense in me telling you how often I send to them. But yeah, three of three from David Edwards. And then to finish it off, we got three of three plus an index card. Bruce Devlin. He's got a nice signature there. Signed in what appears to be a thin blue Sharpie. And the index card. So there you go. 25 autographs from seven people. 21 cards, trading cards, and then four index cards. Hope you enjoyed the video. Feel free to let me know what you think in the comments below. I upload a TTM video every Monday. And then I upload another video on Wednesdays and once on the weekends. So, um, yeah, I always appreciate it. Take care, everybody.